So we have just literally got off the bus. We missed the first bus from the airport. We simply couldn't find it. We're now in the centre of Budapest and the heavens have opened. And this is light in comparison to what we've just had over the last few minutes. And our accommodation is basically um, at the end of that street and we hang a left there. We're actually here in the old Jewish quarters apparently. I thought there was just something a bit different. Why not? So, uh, yeah, interesting. Yeah, like any old city, a uh, lot of graffiti around. Yeah, lots of bits falling off buildings. Yeah, it, it looks quite poor in comparison to uh, Western Europe, but hey, that is to be expected. It's only 30 years outside of. Oh, we've had a right little adventure. This is the lift that we've had to go up to in the fourth floor. It's still a building out of Soviet time. But look at the grand entrance and look at the, the ceiling. Yeah. We've unfortunately had to come right into town to pick up the keys for our apartment, even though we'd already been dropped off and then with all the rain and everything. just stopped here on some benches under the shade <clears throat> and um, we've managed yesterday to get at the supermarket this beautiful bread show us the bread mark oh it's just beautiful dry bread and the sausage is good the cheese is young cheese which I don't prefer but so here we are in the centre of Budapest well, we're actually right on the river. Here's where all the boat cruisers go from. We were today going to go and explore the castle, um, but uh, once we got here, we've decided actually to do something different. We're gonna climb up the hill that is behind us. Um, that bridge that you will see there in front of you, that is called the Chain Bridge. The bridge that we are on at the moment is called Liberty Bridge. So it must have something. To... Wow, look at how pretty that is. It, uh, it looks almost like an old, uh, it looks like a grotto actually. Wow, the two eagles at the bottom, which is obviously must be a reference to the previous royal family. And then up the top, a statue holding the cross. Cause Hungary, I think is predominantly Catholic. I thought that when I came around the corner I recognised this person. Um, this is Sissy. We've come into the castle gardens, one of the fountains, beautifully maintained actually. I'll take you around to the actual castle side. Very different from where we were a few minutes ago. Very different. Um, straight ahead of you, you'll see another water fountain. There's heaps of them in Budapest. Budapest looking towards the cathedral. And the other side of the city. So we were up that hill there before and the Elizabeth Bridge and then the bridge next to it, the green one, is the uh, Liberation Bridge. Coronation Church. Look at that, that's beautiful, eh?
this is just outside of the church and it's called uh, Fisherman's Battalion and the reason why it is called that is because this part of the wall, city wall, was always protected by the fishermen in the medieval times and that's how it gets its name. It's beautiful.